What's up, everybody? It's John, John Sports Talk coming to you with a brand new video. How's everyone doing? Um, it's been a couple days. I hope you had a wonderful Easter, wonderful Passover, a wonderful weekend this past weekend. I got to spend time with my sons, and, and they were away. Uh, came back from a little Florida vacation, uh, going to Disney World and Universal Studios, and I got to see them Sunday, and I'm just so happy I was with them, um, and I miss them very dearly. So it was a nice weekend to uh, round out things with that. So anyway, let's get into this. What is this you're wondering? This is an item that I purchased on Amazon with an Amazon uh, gift card credit that I have. It's from a company called Superior Sports Investments. Inside this box here uh, are 500 baseball cards from the 1950s, 60s, 70s, 80s. This is book value of at least $75. I don't know what to expect out of this thing. It could be a bunch of junk. We could have some gems in here. We I don't know how they when this was packed. It doesn't say. Um, but it's this is hopefully going to be something really, really cool. Uh, it was a unique product that I found. I'm trying to find some unique, cool things to share with you guys. I've got some other things on the way. They're kind of delayed in the mail. And uh, with through uh, things I purchased through eBay and uh, on Amazon as well. But we're going to check this out and see what we have. Ooh, right here, right at the bat. These are probably going to be all commons. I don't know what the condition is right here. But this is, look at this. This is pretty cool. Let's get these out of here. I see some really, really old cards right off the bat. And we're going to see if we got anything good in here. And let me tilt this camera so I can see what I'm looking at. Um... Upper Deck Championship Years. This is kind of interesting. Uh, Babe Ruth card. We'll check that out. This is an old... Um, I believe this is Bowman. I think this is from like... Um, I don't know what year this is from. It's maybe the same year. Oh, it's here. 54. 51. 54. What does it say on there? Let me look here. Uh, 51 Bowman. I think this is the first year of Bowman. Might be. This is really, really beat up, but it's still pretty cool. Blix Donnelly. Uh, you can see the back here is all torn up. So this this would be a, probably wouldn't even be gradable. If it was, it'd probably come back as a grade one. But that's kind of interesting. Uh, I've got this Bill Daly card here. Minnesota Twins. Corners are really soft on this. Um, uh, I can't read the year. It's probably 54 is my guess. This is probably the, one of the oldest cards that we have in our collection now. Uh, so this actually this Bowman one will be. Here's another one of these. Ken Wood, kind of beat up. Really, really beat up. But still pretty interesting. This is from 50. Is it 51 or 54? I can't see. The lighting here is horrible. Let me pull this away. I think it's 51 Bowman. Sorry, folks. You can see this on your computer screen. It's probably huge, and you'll be able to say, John, you can't see. Well, yeah, I wear reading glasses when I'm looking at small things. I do. That's what happens when you get a little older, folks. So when I say I can't see something, it's because I film these videos at night and it could be dark. You know, it's lit in here, but it's just not lit enough. Anyway, let's get back to this. This is Tales of the Game Baby Ruth calls his shot. Um, Tops card here. And then what's this? This is one of the, the cheesy Nolan Ryan cards from the Nolan Ryan set. It's worthless. Um, still a cool card, though. And this is De Denver LaMaster. Uh, again, this is a, this is from 1964, this is from 64 too, sorry, this is from 64, not, not 54, this Bill Daly, okay, so there you go with those cards, let's see what else is in here, not too bad, nothing great, you know, um, so they say, here's 1990 Dharmas, they say cards from the 50s, 60s, 70s, and 80s, not 1990s Dharmas in here. Well, that's not very fair, is it? To kind of cheat and put that in here. So I, you know, what can you do? That's not right. They should say that there's 1990 cards in there. Let's see what else we have here. Um, it's back here. I need to get this little plastic card holders. Okay, let's start out and see what cards we get out of this. You got Dharmas, 87. David Palmer. Uh, this is uh, Topps 87, Carl Willis. I believe this is what year is this? This is uh, 86 or 87, I'm sorry. Um, Fleer, Vern Rule, Donnie Moore, 87. This is Darmus 87, Cliff Johnson, Whitey Herzog. Condition on these is okay. Not too bad. I mean, I think the Spearfield boxes are better. Whitey Herzog, uh, Magic Car from 87, Guy Hoffman, Fleer, Ed Vandenberg is 86 tops, Tim Larry, Ozzy Virgil, Ken Schramm, 
Rick Cerrone, Rich Bordy, Roger Mason, Lou Pinella, Dave Palmer, uh, Gary Renicky, trade uh, a trade checklist. Are these traded? These guys? Uh, yes, this is. These guys are all from the trade sets. Someone must have broke that up and pulled out. I imagine Jackson and Bonds out of the trade set. Those are the two valuable cards out of that. Uh, Tom Needham, Pure Green Minton, Gene Larkin. This is like the whole trade set. <laughs> that is funny. Well, actually, got 86 and they got 87 trade. Sorry, we went into 87. That I don't have. I don't have top 87 trade. Uh, Louis Salazar, Al Newman, Steve Lombardozzi, Jim Sunberg, Steve Shields, Gene Nelson, Brad Havens, Tony Pena, Ray uh, Font uh, Fontenot, Ron Darling, Jeff, Jeff Latai, Scott Gareltz. Giants leaders. These are regular A7. So they switch them on us. Where do they do that? Oh, you can see the difference. See how clean these look? Is Pena part of the trade set? He is. You can see how clean, how different the uh, the, the wood border is actually lighter on those traded cards. Interesting. Uh, Dave Von Olin, Rick Dempsey, Larry McWilliams, Eric King, Jerry Reed, Mel Hall, Juan Bonilla, Mike Woodard, Enos Cabell. Okay. So there's that. Put these right here. Put that there. All right. Let's see what else we have. 86 tops. Regular, regular uh, set. Warren Brewster, Steve Lake, Gary Woods. Got a puzzle piece. Uh, Stan Musial puzzle piece. Got another one. Got another one. Got a whole bunch of them. Okay, this. I'll give this. I'll put this aside. I'm trying to save my puzzle pieces for um, for Danny with uh, 12 again uh, sports. Um, his, I think that's the name of his channel. Sorry, Danny. I watch this stuff all the time. For some reason, I'm having a brain melt here with, with the title. But um, he, I'm going to put some all my puzzle pieces aside for him. Send them out to him at some point. Got Bo Diaz, Doris 81, Willie Norwood, uh, Red Shoden, Shoden Iced, Coach Card, kind of dinged up in the corner. Ron Dressler. We have this whole set upstairs, by the way. So let's go get extra cards here. Scott Sanderson, Jim Fergosi. And Miguel De Leon. Okay. A bunch of Fleers here. Uh, Ian Fleers. General set here. Jeff Blauser, Glenn Wilson, Bill McGuire, Todd Burrell, Bob Stanley, Daryl Boston, Herm Winningham, Otis Nixon, Alvin Davis, Brett Butler, Tom Brookins, Fernando Valenzuela, and Mark Williamson. I'm going fast, guys, because there's a lot of cards here. And um, I apologize. I'm going too fast for you. But I'm trying just to get through this box. We're not here for two hours. Nice. That's kind of a lot. <laughs> they gave us a big stack of these uh, of these, haul these uh, 3D type of uh, cards here. These are not worth a penny and nothing I really need. It's some score. Uh, 91. Oh, nice. So they're lying on the thing about that, too. Nice. Okay. That's not right. I'll probably put a little comment below. That's not cool. Comment on their thing on Amazon. They should be a little more straightforward. I say there's 90s cards in there, too. Scott Bankhead. This is Fleer. Um, 87 again. See, now you have some upper deck. These are not nine. These are not. Are these 89 upper deck? They are, you know, an upper deck. Okay, so let's see if we pull anything here. My guess is these came from someone searching for the for the uh, Griffey Jr. card. Drew Hall, Chuck Jackson, Paul Mirabella, Dave Valley, Bruce Ruffin, Mario Diaz, Milt Thompson, Scott Bankhead, R.J. Reynolds, Jerry Brown, Ken Oberfell, and Chad Kruter. Okay. On to some... Um, 80 action here. So you got Billy Smith, Larry Cox, another Larry Cox, Pat Kelly, Ed Ott, Glenn Borgman, Bob Randall. Okay, and I clear Ron Robinson, Rich Dobson, Mark Langston. This is a rookie. Is this his rookie? No, not. Sorry. I don't know why I thought that. Uh, Don Robinson, Dave Bergman, Oral Hershiser. Mickey Tennelton, Bill Doran, and Dennis Eckersley, and Dave Winfield. My guess is we're not going to find anything super spectacular in here because it looks like they just kind of package these up 
Um, these, who knows? These could have been like world's greatest pack chase cards, and they just box these up and resold them. That's what I'm starting to guess. And then they threw these older cards in here and make it seem like something cool. Um, I don't know where they got this from, though. Uh, Hal Morris, Greg Harris, Jeff Russell, Gerald Perry, 89 Fleer. Okay. Advanced Law, saying any tops, was it Kendo? Now we got some Sport Flicks action. Okay. Um, let's go backward, load the backs of these, and we'll flip them around. We got Dave Winfield. These are like 3D cards. Steve Garvey, Bobby Witt, and these are from 87, looks like. Bobby Witt, Bruce Hurst, and Pete Icavilla. So let's flip these around. You can see, so here's like the Winfield one. It's got like, you can kind of see there's got three different action shots. There's Garvey. This one is Bobby Witt. Here is um, Bruce Hurst. And last one, Peter Gavillian. Okay, sports looks. Uh, what is this? Doris, 1991. So again, lying about the, the, the uh, age of the cards. Not cool. Martinez, Myers, Griffin, Davis... Uh, Nab Holtz, Prokota, Danny Jackson. Ooh, that's not a great. <laughs> that's a pretty bad shot. Uh, Chuck Krem, Luis Gonzalez, Tim Walken, VP Car, Gary Varsho, Dave Rohde. Okay, what's up now? Let's see. Uh, Donris, 87. Okay. So it's in here. Tom Brookins, Neil Allen, Eric Plunk, Gary Pettis. Mike uh, Lloyden, here's the back, by the way. Terry Pendleton, I actually like this year of Dom, it's pretty cool. Terry Pendleton, Al Nipper, Checklist, Leon, Bip Roberts, Mark Portugal, Rick Leach, Manny Trio, Jose De Leon, Carmen Castillo, Dan Plesak, Mike Stanley, Glenn Braggs, Lee Guterman, Jimmy Jones, Odomi McDowell, Kevin Elster, another Kevin Elster, Will Fraser, rookie card, Mike Stanley, Glenn Allen Hill, Bruce Fields, Raider, rookie card, Bob Nipper, uh, Mike Stanley, Ray Keones, another Ray Keones, and Jim Clancy rounds that out. Okay. Nothing special there. Wow. This is turning out to be kind of a bummer. I got 88 tops and kind of some back condition. You can see the rounded corners. Bill Madlock, Bob Denier, and they're really beat up. This one's bent. Not cool. Kurt Ford, Jerry Royce. Joe Negro, Jeffrey Leonard. Uh, this is Benito Santiago, 34 game hitting streaks. Uh, sets a rookie standard card from 88, but that happened in 87. Jim Dwyer, Tigers leaders, Dave Smith, Shane Mack, Bob Ojita, Kenta Colby, Bob Patterson, Lloyd Mosby, Jim Traber, Don Sutton. Okay, I'm getting some really older cards here. Let's see what these are. Let's flip these around. Okay, John Farrell, eight tops. Okay, now, Dave Roberts, that's from 72. I don't have any of this year at all. I may have one or two from reason. Uh, condition's not that great. They're, they're rounded corners. They're not sharp corners at all. You know, these were definitely used, not pulled from a set or anything like that. Jerry Terrell, like a good set. This is uh, 73, right? 74, sorry. Uh, Minnesota 2, Jerry Terrell. He's got a Burger King card here, which is just a checklist <laughs> of the Houston Astros. Thank you very much for that. And look, it's Mark Pen. I love it. Thank you so much. Okay, this is um, this is from 78 Tops, Tom Bergmeier. This is 1960s, 78 card, though. Um, Morris Dale, Maury Stevens, the reprint thing. Got uh, 78 tops, Rick Camp, Larry Melbourne, here's 79, right? 79 tops, Steve Kemp. This is 73 tops, Fleeting Fireman, Sparky Lyle, and Clay Carroll. It's kind of interesting. Put that aside. Bud Harrelson from 73. Put that aside just to have uh, George Mit Mitterwald. Got some stains on there. This is destroyed. This is bad. Bad card. Bad, bad card. Um, 
Yeah, this is from uh, 77 Tops. Really beat up. Steve Stone Trades. I'm get this whole set in mint condition. Just off center cards. This is a bad, bad shape. Jim Cott. And this is from um, 70... What is it? 76? I think. Dick Allen. This is from 76. 1976. I have some of these upstairs, but they're in pretty bad shape. Jim Cott and Dick Allen. Kind of like these. Um... Which before I thought was in terrible shape. Now seeing these kind of cards, I'm like, wow, mine are actually might be in better shape. Okay, so let's put this put this whole pile aside because aside from that crazy Burger King thing, where is that? Let me pull that out of here. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, okay, these are all beat up, worthless cards, but it's still cool to see them, and that's why I bought this because I wanted to check them out and see. You never know what you're gonna find, but now I know that Superior Sports Investments is not a good thing. Uh, Greg Gross. Um, this is the eighty tops again. Checklist card, Jeff Reed, Al Nipper. Because the condition of these are horrific on a lot of these cards. The stick with the Fairfield stuff. That's the way to go. And even those dollar store cards. Those are better in better shape than these. So I would stay away from this company. Let's see if maybe we'll find something spectacular here at the end. I don't think so though. Uh, Jim Waldwind, Wallwander, Scott Bales, and, um, Ar Argina Salazar. Sorry, Ernie Witts, Kurt Young. Denny Martinez. Let's see. Tops. Back to 89. Fleer. Um, kind of stuck here. Mark Eichhorn. Junior Ortiz. Jeff Reardon. 88. Tops, right? Is that what this is? World Series. A Fleer. Sorry. 89. Fleer. That was Tops for some reason. But no, it's Fleer. A uh, World Series highlight card. Another one. Uh, checklist. Dave Point. Jay Buhner. Yeah, this is, that might be his rookie card. Yeah, he got something out of here. Tom Bernanski, Tom Benzinger, Steve Lyons. Whoops. Sorry, guys. I never bumped this camera, and I just did there. Sorry about that. Stickers. Let's skip those. Got some 89 tops here. Jeffrey Leonard, Gina Petrelli, Steve Avery. Draft pick card. I already had that. It's very common, though. Manny Trio, Dave, jo Dave Stewart, sorry. Charles Hudson, Bryn Smith, Kenny Maldonado, Pat Clements, Keith Miller, Juan Samuel, Bob Melvin, Jim Acker, Ray Quiones, Candy Sierra, Robbie Thompson, Ron Robinson, Rick Roden, Ken Williams, Steve Bedrosian, Dale Mohorchik. Okay, that's eight and tops. Okay, Darwis 89, Nelson Lariano, John Moses, Ernest Riles, Ricky Jordan, Keith Miller, Miguel Garcia, Lance Blankenship, Todd Stottlemyre. I think this might, I don't know if this is his rookie or not. It might be. We already have it, I believe. Uh, Jack Savage, look at this whole set. Tim Lauder, Kevin Brown, Francisco Melendez, Jay Howell. Okay. Let's put these back here. Serving my arms over there. Let's see. Got some older cards again. That's cool. Tim McCarver. Nice. This is from 75 Tops. I love this uh, this year. It's really cool. Got a trade checklist uh, card from 74. Jim Sunberg. This is 70. Uh, what is this? 76 or 77? 76. Sorry. Jim Sunberg. Juan Beniquez. Can see Royals team card with Whitey Herzog as a manager. That's kind of cool. Texas Rangers team card. Marshall Expo is no coach listed. Interesting. Okay, got 70, more 70s stuff from Tops. Again, 78. Bill Campbell. Uh, Daryl Johnson manager card. One of these, uh, oh, here's 75. David Earl Nelson, Kansas City Royals. I, I don't know this this brand. This is an odd brand. Um, I'll have to look that up and see what the story is there. With those. With this thing here called SSPC. I don't know what that is. Pacific? I don't know what that is. Okay. Uh, Danny Doyle. Some 77 tops. I love this year, too. Great cards. Ted Simmons, this is, uh, what, 78 again, sorry. I should know that by now. Mike Lum, 78, 76, John Denny, Bobby Cox card, 78, Larry Durker, 
77, Gary Templeton, beat all up badly. Second year card, I think. But beat up, and I'm sure we have this upstairs in much better condition. I should probably start going through those cards to see what I have, because I know that I've got some good ones. Bobby Schultz. Okay, now we're on to John Ellis. This is uh, um, the Topps card from 74. Really, really faded. Those ones I bought on eBay that you've probably seen the videos for. I bought those. They're a really good set-breaking company. And uh, I just bought some basketball cards from him. Um, and uh, his stuff is always primo. The basketball cards came in today, and we'll do a video on them this week. From, uh, I think they're 1977. And it's not the full set. It's missing some cards, which I'll have to hunt. Uh, I think he either broke those out and was selling the rest of these. And I got a really good deal on them. I'm assuming that's what he did. So um, here's 89 Domers. Let's go back to this. Sorry. Main trio. Alex Madrid, the famous. Whoa, yeah. We got another one of these. We're going to make a billion dollars on that card. Mike Devereaux, Bent, Steve Ontiveros, Lloyd McClendon, Jim Gott, um, Paul O'Neill, Larry Anderson, Todd Benziger, Paul Aston Walker, Steve Farr, uh, Scott Gerald, Stan Pasqua, Bill Wegman, Dave Smith. Nothing but blah out of this. I'll tell you what. Um, not good. Ed Lynch, 88 Tops, Jim Gantner, Brian Holman, Kurt Stilwell, Jack Morris, Carmen Castillo, Larry Anderson, Greg Gagne, Tony LaRussa, Scott Fletcher, Vance Law, um, uh, Joe Johnson, Jim Essenreich, Bob Walk, Pittsburgh Pirates announcer, Will Clark, I don't know if this is his rookie. I think 87 is his rookie. Uh, Giant Cardinals leaders, Pena and Herzog. Is that who that is? Herzog, Billy Ripken. Ed Odelwine, Mark Sullivan, Roger McDowell. So nothing spectacular there. Alex Madrid. I guess I got to highlight that at the end, huh? Because that'll be funny. We actually have one of those on, for sale on our eBay store. Not as, the, not as a joke or anything. Uh, I put it up there so that... Um, and I'm not, you know looking to make any money off of it. I was actually looking um, if someone was going to buy it, that they have all the proceeds would go to the Mary Lemieux Foundation. That's why I did it. And I actually did it because another YouTuber actually has it for sale and he's trying to make money off of it. And it was like, I was like, come on, that's terrible. How can you do that? So I kind of like do that as a way to say, hey, that's not cool. I did it the right way. And now we're at 91, a score. Let's just skip all this. I don't even know why they put that in here. If they said there's no 90s cards in here. And these are, again, we got some 88 upper deck. Let's see if we get anywhere. Dwayne Bice, or Bruce Spice, Mike Davis, Andres Thomas, Larry McWilliams, Mike Jackson, Ken Caminetti, second year card, Mark Grace. This might be a rookie card of him. I think we'll put that aside at the end. Tony Fernandez, Jack Howell, Alejandro Pena, Luis Salazar, Gerald Young, Aaron Ricotto, Mike Fitzgerald, Jeff Blauser, Terry Pendleton, John Cerruti, Chet Lemon, Manny Trio, Chili Davis, Bob Horner, Wallace Johnson, Mike Moore, Huey Brooks, Bruce Benedict, Bob Moore, Ernie Witt, Gary Pettis, Mike Sosha, Andres Galarraga, third to fourth year card there, and Ken Daly. We're almost done. We're going to fly through this pretty quick. It's been faster than I expected. 500 baseball cards. 500 cards. Of blah. Nothing great in here. I'm wondering. Some of these look like they could have been from the World's Greatest Pack Chase boxes. And they open them up. And then they um, uh, box these up this way. Um, yeah, it looks like it. Because it just seems that like that. Uh, the A9 upper decks probably. Who knows. Those could have been purchased from... Uh, solo pack, so they there's Herman Jimenez, or I mean, they had a I mean, they had a, a wax box and they opened them up there. So, you got a leaf. This is from 1991. Leaf, I think this is probably series one. You got Bud Black, Kent Herbeck, Tim Tuffle, another Tim Tuffle, another Tim Tuffle, another Tim Tuffle. Oh, that's wonderful! Look at that. How many Tim Tuffles do you put in here? Uh, Superior Sports Investments Boy, I am gonna write, uh, they're gonna get this one. Two, three, four, five, six Tim Tuffles. That's really just so wonderful. Thank you so much. Avon Calderon. Another Avon Calderon. One, two, three, four, 
Four of Von Calderons. Oh, Mike Pagliarulo. One, two, three, four. Four of those. And two Jack McDowell's. Oh, thank you so much for all those multiple cards. I love it. Not really. Lame. Very lame. Um, you got Darius 93, Jack Clark. Oh, look, they did it again. That is so uncool. Chris Spire, Steve Trout from Fleer. Uh, 87. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Upper Deck 99. Yeah, they pulled these out of a... They definitely took these out of one of those greatest pack chicks boxes, boxes, definitely. Dave Collins. Um, this is from... Uh, what year is this from? 87. Fleer again. Sorry. Uh, Dan Petrie, Mark Thurman, Willie Hernandez, Larry Herndon, Dave Bergman, Alan Trammell, Daryl Evans, Willie Hernandez... Bob Denier. Mike Easler, um, A7 Tops. Got more A7 Fleers in there. Alan Trammell, Jim Slayton, Darnell Coles. Got Tigers here. John Denny. All right, what do we got here? 1990. Not supposed to be in this box, though, huh? Jimmy Key, 1990 Upper Deck. Rob Murphy, Pat Sheridan, Brooke Jacoby, Mel Hall, Kurt Manwaring, Glenn Braggs. Greg Briley, Gary Gaetti, Vaughn Hayes, Kent Herbeck, Dave Valley, Juan Augusto, Dave Clark, Dave Smith, Ed Witted, um, Joey Bell, it's Albert Bell. This might be his rookie card um, for that, I think. Fernando Valenzuela batting and Craig Worthington. I don't know if Upper Deck had a trade series set or not. This is it, folks. This is the end. How about that? We flew through this. I'd like, I, really, I should probably sit and count these once we get off camera and see there's actually 500 cards in here. Oh, my gosh. More Upper Deck 1990. Todd, the, the, the false advertising once again. Todd Froworth, Bill Landrum, Kevin Roma, Juan Berenger, Dickie Thone, Shane Raleigh, Charlie Hayes, Mark Guthrie. We can at least have fun, I guess, with this. Oh, we got something semi-decent. A Jeff Bagwell Cup card. Well, thank you very much, uh, Superior Sports Investments for giving this to me. Oh, it's so, so nice of you. <laughs> it's like the best thing we got out of here. This is from um, 92 Tops. Jeff Bagwell, uh, Cup Card. Vince Coleman, Rob uh, Malakot, Bobby Thigpen, Candy Maldonado, Bill Gullickson, Frank Viola, Kenny Rogers. Oh, wait, this is uh, 90s again. Here we go. Sorry, just like totally slipped my mind. Mike Heath. Kim Batiste, Delano De Shield, Jim Gotts, Jose Melendez, Hal McCray, Kelly Downs, Johnny Oates, Stan Javier, Vincent Palacios, Mel Rojas, Lanny Webster, Mickey Morandini, Russ Swan, and Mariana Duncan. Yeah, I'm going to separate these and see how many 90s cards are in here, and then we're going to contact Amazon and say, hey, this, this seller is kind of bogus, and they... You know, put the, put the wrong your cards in here and saying that this is a right here in the box. If you can see that vintage cards from um, uh, starter set, but so what? 50s, 60s, 70s, and 80s. But you don't start to do a starter set and put like six of the same cards, and that's really lame and it kind of kind of cruel. Especially if a kid was buying this, he would probably be very upset. Sid Fernandez, Mark Carrion. This is 91 score. Jeff Ranley. I'm not going to go through these. Let's just go through them quick because you know there's nothing in here of any notes. Nothing good. And here. And here we go again. Here's Upper Deck, uh, Upper Deck 1991. Oh, yeah. Here we go. I would have to say this is a complete bust of a box. But I had to try it out and see. Bernie Williams. Uh, this is a rookie card. So that's cool. Are these the? Oh wait. So they got that. Let's see. If there's some my league players in here. Um, let's just see. I went through them really quickly. I think there's a couple in here. Let's see who they are. Bernard Gilkey. So they do have some my league guys. Bernie Williams. Greg Coburn. Mike Gardner. This is the most interesting thing in the whole thing. Uh, Narcio Elvira. Brian Barnes, Sean Barry, Lance Dixon, Jeff uh, Chimperino, Scott Eldred, Leo Gomez, Maurice Vaughn, Mo Vaughn, that's cool. Dave Hansen, DJ Dozier, 
And Phil Plantier. What team is this? Maybe a team set. Yeah, Star Rookie Rookie Checklist. Interesting. So, um, that's what this is. Oh, Star Rookies Checklist. Okay, so that's what that little logo is. And I thought it was a minor league logo. But it is all rookies um, from 91. Upper Deck, which is not what I was hoping to find in here. This was a complete disappointment. Um... You know, we got these. We got some. There's some '70s cards in here that I don't need to pull out. There are these here. They're really, really, really beat up badly, and uh, no major names. But Harrelson's a good name. But just the the um, the quality of these cards is just bad, just beat up, and very used. And I don't know where they got these from. You got these older ones back here. Well, this is an older. This is like a. a these are reprint cards. These two. For some reason, they thought this was going to be. A really cool vintage card, but it's really not. <laughs> um, that's just a, a really bad series of, of cards. Nolan Ryan. It's like a, in a foil kind of wrapper. We've probably seen those before. These are the old cards they put in here. They did put two old Bowman ones in here, which is remarkable, but they're so beat up. Yeah, 51 series. I don't know. It was right there in front of my face. I'm like looking at this little year down here, and it's right there, John. Look. So 51, Bowman 51 cards. Really, really, really beat up. These probably wouldn't even be a PSA 1, is my guess, because they're so weathered and destroyed. And then you got these 60s cards here. Oh, we got Alex Madrid. Let's make a fortune off of that. And everything's falling apart with the video. Got everything falling down. It's just a sign, isn't it? Got Jeff Bagwell Cup card. That's okay. I think this is Joey Bell, uh, Albert Bell's rookie card for Upper Deck, I believe. I think this is Mark Grace's rookie card for Upper Deck 1989. Okay. You know, he was a good player, but nothing that I'd be, you know, jumping up and down about. Toss Omar, I think this is a uh, rookie for Donruss 89. Steve Avery draft pick card. We have this already, but hey, this is the best highlight. Uh, he's got his high school uniform on in here on this picture. I think this is Jay Buhner's rookie card from Fleur 89. And then uh, we didn't even get to this. This is the Donruss 1990. And I'm not even going to open that up right now. We'll do that off camera. That's it, folks. That's it for this video. I am very, very disappointed. I do not suggest going and buying this if you see this online. Superior Sports Investments. I thought I was going to get something a lot cooler. I thought the cards would be in better condition. And there's only going to be cards in here from 1950s, 60s, 70s, 80s, and there's all this 1990s stuff in here. So they should not have that listed that way. And you guys know that's that's not right. Right? Right. So uh, we'll be sending a message off to Amazon and see if we can get our money back for this thing. And I'd be more than happy to return all the stuff to them because to me, it just is not, it's not anything I can, I, uh, I need. So, um, anyway, that's it for today, folks. Hey, if you like what you see here, not a subscriber, there's a subscribe button. It's right there. There's a little bell right there next to that. You can click on that too. That gives you little notifications every time I put a new video up. We try to do one a day video wise. If not, we'll do uh, one every other day, depending on my schedule and whatnot and what product I have to share with you. Um, if you like this video, that'd be great. Please give it a thumbs up. I love the thumbs up. Um, and then if you have any comments, please put those below. Love to have the nice comments. It's always a good thing. Try to reply to them. I always give them thumbs up and then uh, nice hearts too. If I don't reply to you, I am looking at those though. So thank you for putting all those comments up. You guys have been awesome. We're at 527 subscribers as of making this video today. Um, we're blowing it up. We're going up there. We've got a 500 subscriber, 400 subscriber giveaway kind of combo coming up soon too. So look out for that. We're, we're already, you know, getting to, to like a quarter of the way to 600. So that's good. Um, and then you can share this video too. My we're in the eBay store. I put some new cards up over the weekend. I got more that I've got to get up there. So you can go check that out. The link is down below in the description. I hope you like this video. It was not our was not um, our best video at all, but it was kind of fun. But it was also kind of disappointing too. This uh, 500 card box of uh, uh, baseball cards, vintage cards, supposedly from the 1950s, 60s, 70s, and 80s, from a company called Sports. Uh, Spirit Sports Investments. We purchased this on Amazon. I do not recommend this at all. So run away from this thing if you see it. Run away from this company if you see them anywhere. Um, and they're not a very good repack repackaging company with these cards by any stretch of the imagination. That's it for today, folks. Hope you love this video. We'll be back soon with more stuff in the next day and day or so. So look out for our new videos coming up shortly. That's it for today, folks. Thanks again for watching the John Tom Sports Card. Signing off. We'll see you all soon.